Yes, today we are going to look at parameters. Sometimes you might find x and y are given in a function of a certain very uh, third variable or called a parameter. And they want you to find the y, the x. So in this instance, what do we do to find our dy, dx in terms of t? So first of all, we shall start with our x. If my x equals to t to power 3, I hope you can see, t to power 3 plus t squared. Therefore, my dx dt will equal to 3t squared plus 2t. I hope you are following. So this is my dx dt. Another thing what I'm going to do, if my y if my y is t squared minus t so my dy dt will be 2t minus 1 I hope we can agree up to that level no one is lost so that we can proceed but another thing which I want to show you before that still my dt dx will equal to 1 over 3t squared plus 2t. I hope you agree. If my dx dt equals to this, then my dt dx will equal to this. Yes, we are together. So, I shall bring my dy dx my dy dx which I want to find is equal to dy dt times dt dx that is my dy dx if I'm to find it so my dy dt I already have it here which is 2t minus 1 times dt dx of which I already have here which is 1 over 3t squared plus 2t so my my dy dx will equal to 2t minus 1 over 3t squared plus 2t of which you can go further and simplify so I'll have my 2t minus 1 over I have a common factor which is t so I'll make it to go out I'll remain with 3t minus 2 so this is my dy dx so the the, 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 the subtopic of parameters you can be given x in terms of a certain variable and y also in the certain variable and you may be required to find the y dx so this is how you go along with such numbers and uh, work on them or solve them in the simplest way possible so thank you very much please like subscribe comment uh, other new videos are coming they are on their way thank you very much